the best gaming mouse feels suitable for your grip and offers excellent performance with your favorite games. Getting a mouse that feels molded for your hand, has the right set of features, and packs a powerful sensor will improve the flow of your gameplay and make the hits you land feel more satisfying. There are dozens of companies in the gaming industry today, and models can range from cheap and simple pointers to premium devices that can boast helpful features like wireless charging or banks of programmable buttons. There are also some bold design choices out there, like flashy RGB, removable parts, and even adjustable weights on some models. We have listed the top 5 gaming mouse and their key features, plus the things you need to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all the products with the best prices mentioned in the video are in the description below. You can also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, guidinggear.com. Number 5. Corsair Sabre Pro The Corsair Sabre RGB Pro Champion series may lack all of the frizzles and pizzazz of other mice for gaming, but its minimalistic design is made up for by its speed. Designed by esports gamers, this mouse is all about being fast with its 8000 polling rate, the Exxon hyper-processing technology, and quick strike buttons with fast actuation. During testing, we could see the difference between this and other gaming mice, finding it to be far more accurate even in busy, fast-paced scenarios. We could very quickly zero in on our targets without overcorrecting, allowing us to home in our targets and fastly improving our kill to death ratio. Factor in lightweight, special pads, and very flexible cable, and it truly feels like a natural extension of your hand. And it does so without setting you back a whole lot, making it the best gaming mouse for competitive gamers who want to be economical. Number 4 Red Dragon M686 Vampire Elite You might have heard of Red Dragon before. The company's affordable, well-built M686 Vampire Elite is currently just $40 and carries many hallmarks of a premium wireless gaming mouse. That includes 8 buttons you can program, including with macros and fast USB-C charging via its 5'9'' period cable. If you're a gamer whose budget tops out at $50, this may be the best wireless mouse for you. Red Dragon claims just 5.5 hours to a full charge. In a rare move, Red Dragon included grooves for righties to rest their ring and pinky fingers on this mouse. Many mice neglect these digits, leaving them dragging on the mouse pad. The M686 shape comfortably serves a person's larger hands and also accommodates wide grips. The M686 has soft, rubber side grips and the rest of the chassis has smooth, almost gel-like feel. It's nice but can lack resistance, especially by the left and the right click buttons. Meanwhile, the scroll wheel is tactile but still glides pretty smoothly and shows slight wobble, making precise scrolls hard. And you won't get the same springy feel from left and right click buttons that pricier wireless gaming mice offer. The M686 PixArt PMW3335 sensor goes up to 16,000 dpi, 450 ips, and 40 grams. Those specs match more expensive mice and mainstream users won't notice any tracking issues, whether using lowest or highest setting. I never suffered any dropouts over my few weeks using it, including a couple of days of pairing it with a wireless keyboard. Unfortunately, Red Dragon's free software for the M686 is almost mandatory, because out of the box the three side buttons are programmable to Alt, Control, and Shift. You only get one profile with onboard memory, and very few Windows programs are launchable via the mouse. RGB is also limited to a rainbow effect. Breathing one color or outputting a static color, that is, there is a color picker and the ability to enter red, green, and blue values. Red Dragon claims up to 45 hours of battery life with Eco Mode, which confines RGB to the scroll wheel. The software provides a meter reading, but confusingly, even the battery fully charged, the software reads 90 for me. After about 11 hours of using the mouse at RGB set to max brightness and speed, the app said 70% battery remained. If you'd prefer a more familiar name, the Logitech G305 Lightspeed is sometimes sold for $40, depending on the color, but it isn't rechargeable. Number 3. SteelSeries Rival 5 One of the top honors goes to the SteelSeries Rival 5 for being impressively capable and stunningly affordable. This pick doesn't leave much else to be desired with its $60 price point and versatility. Impressively, SteelSeries actually increased the number of buttons available on the Rival 5 over those found on the Rival 600. You get your usual assortment, plus a third button situated near the front of the mouse as well as two-way, flickable buttons above the back and forward buttons. This makes it a great combo of an average gaming mouse and MMO or MOBA option. The Steel Series Rival 5 follows the trend of gaming mice shedding weight, and it's slightly cut back from the Rival 600. Part of that weight loss may come from the omission of a depth sensor, but the Rival 5's true move air optical sensor still provides solid tracking. Being a wired option also helps contribute to its lightweight. An added perk is the considerable RGB lighting on board with a zone at the scroll wheel, a zone in the Steel Series logo on the palm rest, and two RGB strips on each side of the palm rest, each with four independent lighting zones. Number 2. Logitech G502 Lightspeed A lighter, wireless version of the popular Logitech G502 Hero, the wireless Logitech G502 Lightspeed is a fantastic weapon for your arsenal if you can stomach the price tag. With premium features like 6 additional weights for customizing the mouse's feet, the G502 Lightspeed starts earning your investment. With Logitech's high DPI and power-efficient hero sensor and an ample number of programmable buttons, the G502 Lightspeed is fit for any gaming genre. 
Its shape is familiar and comfortable, crafted in first-person shooter style. When you can't risk a wireless connection, the G502 Lightspeed also comes with a reliable cable. In addition to connecting your PC with a wireless dongle, you can make it so you never have to connect the G502 Lightspeed to a cable at all, not even for charging. With the Logitech G Power Play wireless charging mousepad, the mouse is always charged as long as the pad is plugged into a USB port. Sadly, the mousepad takes away the ability to use either of the G502 Lightspeed's foreground base and is currently $120. If you like a mouse that can charge wirelessly with a broader variety of mousepads, consider Qi Charging Mice, like the Corsair Dark Core RGB Pro SE. Number 1. Razer Basilisk V3 The Razer Basilisk V3 is the best gaming mouse to hit our lab. Its 9 programmable buttons, well-crafted shape, and premium textured finish make it versatile across gaming genres and even productivity workloads. While on the heavier side, compared to honeycomb style mice for FPS games, PDFE feet help it glide easily, and dedicated sniper button is easy to reach and drops DPI instantly for headshots. Customization options abound, from the 11 individual RGB zones to the aforementioned buttons, each button can also have a secondary function when using Hypershift. The Basilic V3 is also unique in its scroll wheel's ability to swap from a tactile to smooth free scroll at the top of a button or based on how you flick it. However, that does mean that the wheel can sound rally and is particularly noisy when switching modes. It can also wobble when shifting side to side aggressively. The Razer Death Hatter V2 is a worthy simpler alternative if you don't need that much programmability. But the Basilisk V3 earned our top spot with its advanced feature set, build, and customization option. Let us know in the comments which model works for you the best and why. Thank you for watching the video and that is all for this one. If you find this video helpful in any way, give a huge thumbs up, stay tuned for the upcoming videos by subscribing to our channel. Hope to see you in the next video, till next time, see you guys later.